Hang on, guys. <laughs> Okay, we're here to um, have a look at the Big White Monkey's latest amplifier. Um, this is a new improved model of their Silverback. Uh, fully tube, all Sovtech valves, um, that even the rectifier is a valve. Um, it's 15 watt, seems to kick, uh, kick out. We're not really cranking up too much here because I'm just in an apartment, unfortunately. Um, and we're just running it through a high watt double 12 cab. Great cabs, by the way. Um, now this uh, amp doesn't have an overdrive section so it's just purely clean um, it's based on a, um, a Fender Princeton which I'll give you more information about that later so we're just using a rat pedal at the moment that's the only one that's on there uh, for its distortion here's what it sounds like without it <laughs> This is not exactly the cleanest guitar in the world, um, but it has good rock tones. Um, it also has, this amp has an intensity on it. Just kicked it in with the foot switch. Uh, that can be set around a few different ways. Let's go extreme. And obviously we can slow that speed down to whatever suits and make it less intense. For those retro guitar players who like that, that kind of thing, just switching it out now. Um, yeah, so there you go, clean, the rap pedal for a bit of distortion. <laughs> To be honest, the rap pedal probably takes away a little bit of the full bass sound. It seems to cut that off a little bit, but it uh, makes it very defined. But uh, everything sounds nice and tight, full, um, sweet, so I'm impressed. Here's a little bit of a rundown on it. <clears throat> uh, so as I said, it's a clone of the Fender Princeton. Uh, it's got a little twist though. It has a boost switch, which um, switches between a black face and a brown face tweed version. Um, I'll give you a listen to that right now. Well, when I do put the uh, boost on, it gets very loud. So I'll have to adjust the volume. Yeah, you'll hear it gets a little bit more mid-range, a lot more vintage sounding, to be honest. <laughs> back to the other sound which I'll need to knock the volume up again so you can hear that mid-range immediately just dipped it's got a nice full spectrum of, of frequency going on yeah so I'm, I'm digging what it can do um, Let's see what else we've got to tell you here. Um, so in the blackface selection, uh, the you have the total, you have the control over the EQ giving a sparkling, spanky Fender tones. And with the brown face, the tone stack is lifted and so it gets dirty. Um, the amp has an onboard tremolo unit, which we just had a look at. And um, and as I said, all, all valves. We've got a... Um, 5AR4 valve as a rectifier, 212AX7s as a preamp, and two GV6GTs in the power section. Um, this amp is hand wired with quality components, blah blah blah. Uh, it has a Perspex turret board, turret board, 
um, with no PCBs in sight. Um, it's got two speaker out outputs and uh, selectable impedance, so you can go from 4 ohms, 8 ohms, 16 ohms. Uh, and then at the back it has another presence control, um, which I've actually tried just before we plug this in. Um, I actually liked it with the presence up full. It had a little bit more of a sparkly fender sound, um, like a fender amp sound. Um, I can probably give you a quick, it's pretty subtle, so I'll give you a quick listen to the difference. <coughs> it's with the presence up full. <laughs> And then, with the presence rolled out, so it's only quite subtle, but it's enough. So again, I'm putting it back up full. Uh, but it's a, it's enough, and uh, certainly if you don't like that extra bit of high end, then you can definitely roll it down, and will help. Um, so Big White Monkey offer free postage within Australia um, and if you need a cabinet they do some cabinets with uh, some good old vintage 30s Celestians in them um, so you can uh, definitely speak to them about it chase them down um, on Facebook just type in BWM or Big White Monkey I'm sure you'll find them and um, they're an Australian company and uh, yeah, so it's Free postage in Australia, can't go wrong with that. And they'll even throw in a, a speaker lead for you free. So I'll just twiddle around a little bit more so you can have a listen to the actual tone. Remembering, of course, that without the rat pedal, this is... Just a good, honest valve amp. Um, Sounds actually really impressive, I think, and no doubt the price is going to be very impressive because these guys keep the price down, but give you good quality equipment. Uh, here's with the rat pedal. Check it out, Big White Monkey. <laughs> 